My name is Bailey Stenson and I'm one of the farmers at Happy Heart Farm CSA in Fort Collins, Colorado. A CSA is an arrangement where you can get local vegetables and come meet the farmer and see where the vegetables grow and see how the vegetables are grown and meet the other like-minded folks that enjoy this food as well. And right behind me now, we have many of our harvest helpers harvesting our tomatoes. Everyone wants to know where their food is grown. It's not from another country, it's right in our own backyard. And they want to know what is good about the food that's grown. That foods are grown without poisons and pesticides and other toxic substances. Our farm is different than a grocery store in that our members support our farm in advance of getting their vegetables. They're almost like our bank. They give us our money before our season begins so we can buy seeds and tools and pay for salaries before our harvest is even completed. Our members come and get their vegetables on Tuesday evenings between four and seven. It's a party. We have a wonderful time together. We tell stories, we swap recipes, we care for each other's children, and we enjoy the wonderful food we grow. We grow a variety of vegetables. We grow everything from early spring greens, spinaches, lettuces, basil, tomatoes, just about everything but sweet corn because the raccoons love our sweet corn. We have lots of helpers on our farm, from the farmers themselves to our young apprentices to working members to volunteers. Today we're busy harvesting our tomatoes. This is liquid gold sunshine in the form of tomatoes that we make delicious sauces for spaghettis and pizzas and all wonderful things. Rain alone doesn't water all our crops. So we use water also from the Poudre River. And that water comes to us from the Pleasant Valley Ditch. And we have a drip irrigation system that individually waters each plant here. This saves us so much time. We never could hand water all the food that we grow. And when it rains, we are so thankful. This year has been abundantly wet and each time it rains, it saves us up to eight hours of work to water our plants. So we celebrate when it rains. Hundred and fifty years ago in Fort Collins, when Fort Collins was beginning, people got their food just like we're growing it today. It, their food was grown by hand without a lot of machinery. Maybe they had horses. Uh, we have had horses that pull plows here, big draft horses. Their water came from the Poudre River. Our water comes from the Poudre River uh, via the Pleasant Valley Ditch. And they were just as open to the differences of nature. One day it might be hailing, the next day it may be sunny, but they use the same methods that we use today. Bikes on the farm are a wonderful thing. I get on my bike at the top of the hill and ride my bike down the hill to the fields and it starts my day in a really fun way. We also use the bikes to haul our vegetables up to our cooler after we pick them so we don't have to use gasoline to do that. Also, we use our bicycles just for fun and enjoyment. When we're not farming, we get on our bikes and we ride on the bike trail in the town or along the river.
So here we have our Anaheim peppers. If you ever have had chili rellenos, this, are, this type of pepper is a mild pepper and it's stuffed with cheese and put in a batter and cooked so delicious. This is our wonderful eggplant. As you can see, it's multicolored and it will get quite large before we harvest it. And I love eggplant parmesan. This is our leek family here growing and the leeks are actually in the lily family. It has a beautiful leaf like a lily. And we love this for leek potato soup, grilling leeks, so delicious. So here are our beets growing and I'm gonna harvest one so you can see how big and delicious they are, fresh from the ground. I love beets uh, to eat the greens with a little butter and lemon. And I love the beets either grated in salad or roasting them in the onion oven with other vegetables such as potatoes and carrots and onions. And you can even pickle them as well. All of us are picking our green beans right now. And if you notice, some aren't just green. We have purple and yellow and green beans. And I love to eat my green beans just fresh off the plant, but my son's favorite thing is pickled green beans. And they have a little hot red chili pepper in them, which makes them really fun. <laughs> That's good. Buy local means that we support people who grow food in our neighborhoods and that allows farmers and their helpers to stay in business. We like to know who enjoys our food. The days are long on the farm, the weather can be extreme, and to know who is enjoying our food and benefiting from our food is one of the best gifts the farmer can have.